On the final day of the NJCAA D3 Nationals, the Montgomery College Raptors faced the Brookhaven College Bears from Texas, with third place in the nation at stake. Both teams had come off heartbreaking losses in the semis. MC was edged by Erie, losing on penalty kicks, while Brookhaven had lost to SUNY Broom 1-0. And from the perspective of most observers, this was a match between two of the best possession teams in the country, and they were right. Possession was a huge factor all afternoon. And Brookhaven had the better of it in the early going, keeping the ball in their offensive end and coming close on a couple of opportunities. But despite that, MC jumped out in front. Here's Galen Hirabayashi with a free kick after a Brookhaven foul. Natalie Alviar pushes it ahead to Ariella Amaguana. She beats the defense. The Bears keeper comes out, but Amaguana kicks it over her outstretched arms and into the net to put MC up 1-0. Minutes later, the Bears with a great chance to tie when Jocelyn Sordo gets a nice run down the side. But MC's Rochelle Andino forces her wide and MC keeper Jennifer Pineda snags it. But just moments later, the Bears attack again. There's a nice through ball and this time it's just Sordo and Pineda one-on-one -on -one, and Sordo wins it to tie it at one. Six minutes later, MC on the attack again. Alviar gets it to Alejandra Ramos and she takes it right through the middle of the Brookhaven defense, showing off her footwork and power as bang, she knocks it in from 25 yards out to put MC up 2-1. But Brookhaven had an answer. Alexis Lopez serves one up and Jasmine Bustos is there to head it in and tie it at two at the half. Second half now and like all game long, every possession was contested to the max. This time, Jocelyn Flores wins it with some fancy footwork. She gets it to Claire Couturier who weaves through the Bear defense and powers a beautiful shot into the far corner to give MC a 3-2 lead. But Brookhaven answered quickly. After a goal-saving foul by MC's Andino gave the Bears a free kick. There's Brenda Hernandez. She sends a laser into the far corner to tie it at three with 35 minutes to go. Then just two minutes later, the Bears attacking again. There's a pass to space. Sordo picks it up and hits the near corner to give Brookhaven a one goal lead. And they added another moments later to up their lead to 5-3. So now it was desperation time for MC. They get a great chance to draw closer on a corner. Couturier puts it in front of the goal. Ramos redirects it to Flores. She lets fly with a beautiful shot, but the Brookhaven keeper with a stellar play to protect the lead. And Brookhaven's defense shut down MC the rest of the way to earn the 5-3 win and claim third place in the nation. Now there's no doubt the Raptors are disappointed to have their season end this way, but we can't forget what a terrific year this team put together. They finished 17-3-1, they won Maryland Juco, they won Region 20 and the districts, and they finished fourth in the country. By any yardstick, it was a fantastic season for a wonderful team of young women led by a group of great young coaches. This team brought a lot of joy and pride to Montgomery College this season, and they deserve our thanks. For the Raptor Report, I'm Michael Brown.